this season in particular, there is really something for everybody. It's not like everything kind of has one note. There's definitely options out there. We're kind of emerging out of heavy, almost recession fashion. We're not in stark blacks anymore, but there is still a melancholy undertone. It's also referencing some periods in history that might not have been as happy-go-lucky <laughs> as, as other times. So we're seeing a return of punk and a rebellious culture. Really young, fun, rock and roll style. And then we're also seeing a lot of old world almost dressing. Kind of this great, classic, rich, 1950s kind of feel, accessories from eras gone by. You know, the colors of the season are jewel tones and they're a little darker and they're a little richer. If you don't own anything burgundy or oxblood leather, I think you are making a mistake. No matter what kind of color palette you have going on in your wardrobe, it fits really nicely in and it just feels so beautiful and luxe and unexpected. We're seeing that burgundy color pop up in makeup as well, but definitely the lip is kind of the key. If you're gonna buy something, buy a great lipstick in a nice deep fall shade and that's all you're gonna need. You know, I know a lot of people get really confused and frustrated when they go into stores because they just see pieces hanging. Westfield Sound Magazine kind of gives you the confidence of seeing these pieces already laid out in amazing outfits. And then you can kind of go in and really kind of cherry pick the things that are gonna work for you.